All right, we're about to replace some 2003 Silverado taillights. I got a new set of taillights off the internet. Nothing fancy whatsoever. Just search for your model. Anything should be good. Comes with a long flex loom. We got to get from underneath the truck and then replace with this long flex loom. All right, I'm laying underneath the truck on a flat surface with the truck in park and the wheels chalked. We got this is the light wire coming down through the bed, through the side of the bed from the light fixture. We got these little plastic looms and that plugs into one harness over here. Now to get these looms out, just use a flathead screwdriver and pry in and then kind of flip and those pop right open. We're gonna push this and unplug this wire and that's it. Pull the whole thing out. To remove the old lights, two screws on the side, one here, one here. Just Phillips said, take them out. I've already got them kind of loose, as you can tell. Hold on to these, and then the light itself just pulls right out. And you pull the harness out with it. All right, the light's out. Reverse procedure wire in this hole, feed down to below, put the fixture in place, put the two screws in. Feeding the wire loom down inside the hole so I can grab it down below and put it in the clips after routing it through the frame. All right, the new wire is through the hole, routed up above this frame bracket for the tailgate section. All the little clips are clipped back into place. No wires plugged in in the original location. Left is the same as the right. Lights loose. Wiring harness down through the hole. We got to unclip, unclip it down below, and I'm going to pull the whole thing out just like the other side. All right, check it out. The loom is coming through the hole in the bottom of the bed underneath the light opening. It's clipped back in. This loom is a little extra long, so as you can see, I've got it kind of tucked up in the bed frame until I can get a zip tie from the shop. And then it just simply plugs in on top, and we've got our lights installed. All right, as you can see, I've got some extra help. New tail lights are in. The left tail light, just the reverse process of the right light, put the loom through the bed frame bracket, plug it in, put the clips back in, screw the light in with these two screws, top and bottom. And now we're about to try it out. As you can see, it is super time for new lights. All right, I'll test the brake lights out in a little while with my sons. But as you can see, the lights are working in hazard condition. And we are looking like we've got some brand new lights on the Chevy. All right, just to reiterate, these are not OEM. These are internet popular auction site specials. The right light fits super good, fits almost OEM, decent gaps. And eh, maybe not at the top, side looks good, etc. But the left light has a little bit of a weird gap that seems to be a little loose on the screw. So maybe it's adjusting I can do, but it seems to be out just a tiny bit. But all in all, I'm super happy to have some nice working lights on this 20-year-old truck. Thanks. Hit me a subscribe if you don't mind. All right, the old lights packaged up in the box, ready for the recycle or the trash. And again, the lights are working perfect. Thanks for watching. Hit me a subscribe if you wouldn't mind. Would greatly appreciate it.